Lori Harvey is one of the top it girls in our social media world today. She has been able to carve her own space online from her high profile relationships to her modeling career and her entrepreneurial pursuits. So today's video is going to be an it girl case study dedicated to Lori Harvey. So Lori Harvey was born on January the 13th, 1997, making her a Capricorn. She is an American model, entrepreneur and socialite. She was born in Memphis, Tennessee and she grew up in Atlanta. Georgia. So Lori Harvey is the daughter of Majori Harvey and even though her identity of her biological father is unknown, um, Steve Harvey did actually adopt her once he got married to her mother. In 2015, she began a career in modeling, signing modeling contracts with LA Model Management Agency in the United States and Selects Model Management in Europe. Harvey has walked the runway for Dolce & Gabbana's 2017 Spring and Summer Collection and she has appeared in campaigns for Valentino, Pat McGrath and Burberry. In 2021, she launched the skincare brand Skin by LH. That same year, she collaborated for a clothing collection with the company Naked Wardrobe. One thing I really admire about Lori Harvey is her determination with her fitness goals. So in May 2022, she actually posted a video on TikTok explaining her major weight loss, which included a 1,200 calorie diet leading up to the Met Gala, and she looked absolutely gorgeous. I'm going to actually show the clip of her explaining in her whole diet regime right now okay so i just left my pilates class and i see uh, the girls are signing up for pilates now love that for you guys um but everybody's been asking like what it is i specifically did to get my body to this point so when mike and i got together i gained like 15 pounds of relationship weight and it was horrible none of my clothes fit it was just not okay so I've been consistently doing Pilates for like the last year. I've done it for a few years, but I've been really consistent the last year. And when I was trying to drop weight, I was working out like five, six times a week. And I would even do like for the first month and a half, I think I did two a days. So what I would do was I was in a calorie deficit. I think I maybe was consuming like 1200 calories in a day max. And I wasn't on like a specific eating regimen I just was trying to do like meat and veggies and like minimal carbs and then I had this sprint interval circuit that I would do so I would do Pilates in the morning and then I would leave there and I would sometimes directly go to the gym and hop on the treadmill for 30 minutes and it's a specific sprint interval workout I did so if you guys want that I'll give it to you later so then I would do that or I also like to do like a hike or I would go run the stairs, just some type of cardio. That's how you drop because Pilates alone is not going to make you lose weight. It's just going to give you long lean muscles. So yeah, that's how I did it. Now I know she did get a bit of backlash because the calories wasn't a lot, but the fact that she had this routine, she stuck to it and her body goals are now like absolutely amazing it just goes to show that putting in hard work will get you the results you want so a little bit about her dating pursuit in january 2016 she began dating the dutch footballer memphis and they were engaged in 2017 but the couple split later that same year following the end of her engagement was temporarily linked to lewis hamilton trey songs justin combs and also p diddy wow not his father too <laughs> eventually she then began dating the rapper future and the pair confirmed their relationship in january 2020 and broke up in august that same year so the relationship was very quick and future was very petty he dissed her on his song maybach but who cares because future is an excuse of a man anyways <laughs> so then in november 2020 harvey began to date the actor michael b jordan and in december 2021 jordan declared in an interview that he finally found what love is and in december 2021 jordan declared in an interview with the hollywood reporter that he finally found what love was but in 2022 they broke up uh they're not together anymore that one was a bit sad I, I did feel like they were a very cute couple it was really giving ultimate strong black love but we move and i love Lori harvey for several different reasons but first she emulates such grace and class like she just has this 
soft yet assertive persona where she speaks you're gonna listen and i admire her willingness to put herself first this is evident in her past relationship more specifically when the relationship is no longer serving her she's ready to leave with no questions asked as long as you're not compromising on like your core values and beliefs yeah, and like agreed. that's it that's <laughs> it okay describe how taking control improves the overall dating experience I think you'll just be happier at the end of the day. Yeah. I'm very much in a space right now where I'm not doing anything that's gonna compromise my peace and happiness. Yeah. So I think just taking control, t making sure you like maintain your power, don't give your power away to anybody, that I feel like is the key to like truly being happy. That's something a lot of us females need to start doing, putting ourselves first and not being afraid to walk away from a toxic relationship. Realizing that we are worthy of high quality love so we're not settling for anything less just so we can say we have a man like let's not do that not in this day and age so for makeup lori harvey is often seen rocking a neutral soft glam makeup look which focuses on a subtle smoky eye and nude lips as for her fitness she is definitely big on fitness as i have explained and this is evident through her current body shape where it's very toned yet curvaceous at the same time she's actually also modeled for gymshark which was really interesting to see like i was on gymshark's website the other day and i saw laurie i was like okay girl okay <laughs> as for fashion laurie has a mix of different styles if she's running day-to-day -day errands we'll often see her in jeans leggings or some sort of co ward set but if she's going to an event she has a lot of like classy slash extravagant outfit styles that i've seen in different looks and as for her character she overall has a gentle and feminine personality she's very soft-spoken and i like the fact that she gives off mystery so you'll never really know what she's up to so guys that was it for the it girl k study i hope you guys enjoyed if you did make sure you give it a thumbs up subscribe for more and i'll see you guys very soon bye